position, Doctor. Tell me when. This man comes back to delay on my end. There's no more time to waste. Set the timer for 15 minutes. Let's go, Rue. Five minutes should be plenty. Here I go. Oh, get the chaos before the military fight. So, welcome back to my Let's Play of Sonic Adventure 2 Battle after my hour-long hero catch-up little event that I had. Um, which, really, I'm just gonna admit here, was just a result of me completely forgetting that I, uh, had already recorded my first half of, a. Uh, this is why I don't do live let's play, because I was for But I had forgotten that I had already quoted the first half of the let's play uh, for the hero side. And instead dove straight into a second part. And it just wound up being an hour. Oh hey! Only two more! That was... Okay! It just wound up being longer than I expected it to. Mostly because I can't believe that I was doing. Shut your friggin' mouth! But mostly because I had uh, forgotten that I how long I had been recording. It's gotta be close. Only one more left. Third time. Wow. I am just blasting through this level. But uh, don't worry. We're gonna screw up here in a bit. Well, that was the pretty quick run through. Not bad. How was that? Perfect? Like me? No, that's what we call lucky. Cause uh, normally you have to at least there's at least one emerald where you have to dig into the vaults to get it. In order to dig in the vaults, you have to activate them, and I completely forgot how to do that. I can't believe I've come this far just to fail. This is Flying Dog Headquarters. Intruder found entering security board. Preparing to attack. And now we encounter our third uh, boss of this type. Uh, but this one's just a little bit special because he doesn't have any uh, legs. But this one is uh, fundamentally more similar to Shadows and Sonic's. Uh, he has that little charge shot as well as his ability to, or his uh, typical pattern of running like in figure eight and shooting lasers and whatnot. And I guess typically what you're supposed to do is dive into him when he's doing uh, the charge shot, but you're supposed to use Rouge's drill dive or whatever. Which, I mean, he's not that hard. He's definitely a little bit harder than fighting with Sonic or Shadow, because you have more control with Sonic and Shadow. Uh, with the homing attack, to uh, freely attack him and with the Rouge, random Rouge can glide, but she's gliding with Rouge and then diving down into the cockpit. It's a little bit harder than it looks. I was making it look easy before. Oh, I didn't even know he had the rocket pods. Well, I mean, I guess obviously he did, but I didn't know we actually shot him. This is not going to hit. So, can you just fly into the thing? I wonder. I guess that's something wrong. I guess you can. This flying dog can't be destroyed. I always tried to. I always did the drill dive into it. I thought that was how you were supposed to damage it. I guess rule number one of the Sonic universe still applies, huh? This is Rouge. I've got a small problem. I can't believe that I'm trapped inside this locked safe with a Chaos Emerald. <laughs> I guess I won't be able to call myself a treasure hunter anymore. Shoot, troublemaker. 
And now we come to Shadow's version of Green Forest, the White Jungle. That's racist. Honestly, I'm not the best at this one. Wow, did that really just happen? I guess so. That was terrible. Okay, take two. Oh, uh, in this level we will be getting Shadow's Air Dash, or Lightspeed Dash, whichever you want to call it. It's the Air Shoes. Uh, the gimmick in this level, it's got a lot of those slingshots, and uh, you'll find yourself somersaulting all there are a lot of obstacles. Honestly, overall, I prefer Green Forest better, both in soundtrack and in level layout. But I don't mind White Jungle, it's not bad. It's just kind of slows down a little bit for me. You know, unfortunately, unless you're really good at hitting those somersaults at high speed, you'll be sobbing quite a lot. Like that. Which just kind of annoys me. I like to keep moving. That's why I like Sonic games. And we'll come under here, go through this uh, pathway, and I think we find the air here. here. Obviously. Ah, uh, reuse stage elements. See them the door. No. Bad. You know, I should probably just run. But I'll have to be a special snowflake, I have to be unorthodox. Oh yeah, hair shoes. Uh, yeah. You know, I kind of half wonder if I could make the jump to that spring. Uh, the air shoes function identically to the light dash shoes, or the light speed shoes, whatever you want to call them. They are fundamentally just that gameplay mechanic for Shadow. Granted, this game is old as sin, most of you probably know this, but on the off chance that you actually haven't played this game... Ah, uh, we just blew past big. You know, when I was a kid, I didn't notice all of his appearances. Now that I'm older, I can't unsee him. And that was White Jungle. Here we go. Next cutscene might be a little familiar. Ultimate victory. Hey, that's... That blue hedgehog again of all places. I found you, Faker. Faker? I think you're the fake hedgehog around here. You're comparing yourself to me? Huh. You're not even good enough I'll to be my I'll make you eat those fish. words. You can't get away this time. There's only one real Sonic. Well, we're not pretending to be Sonic. Hut. We're Shadow. We're better. Hut. 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 We're the ultimate Bring life form. You're just Sonic. Hey, is that? Hey, he is down there. Hut. 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 Shadow, Shadow the Hedgehog. No! No time to hang out with the likes of you. <laughs> wow, that was terrible. I can't believe I got that. Shadow, what are you doing? Hurry and get back here right now before the island blows up with you on it. Blows up. Can 
That's a weird position for his model that never looked right to me. Shadow, what do you think it's like on Earth? The professor said his life's work was dedicated to all of those who live down there. He once told that the reason for his existence was making people happy through the power of science. Shadow. Maria, I just don't know anything anymore. I often wonder why I was created, what my purpose is for being here. Maybe if I go down there, I, I will find the answers. Maybe. Maria. Why so melancholy? That was so unexpected, so unlike you, Shadow, to come and rescue me. But your ability to use the Chaos Control certainly comes in handy. You know, I didn't come to save you. I came back for the Chaos Emeralds. Yeah, yeah, but then again, that's not the whole story, is it? Everything is ready to go! Are you sure? We only have six of the seven Chaos Emeralds, you know? It's more than enough for the demonstration. So let's get the show on the road. <laughs> Citizens of Earth, lend me your ears and listen to me very carefully. My name is Dr. Eggman, the world's greatest scientist, and soon to be the world's greatest ruler. Now witness the beginning of the greatest empire of all time. <laughs> Well, that happened. Why are you so upset? Well, that was really impressive. You've managed to create complete havoc on the whole planet. Does this now mean we control the planet and can do as we choose? At this rate, the cannon will take too much time to charge up. If you want to unleash its full potential, you'll need all seven Chaos Emeralds. Where in the world have you been? Something happened? Our threats fell on deaf ears. Look at you, throwing a tantrum like a little kid. How totally embarrassing. Don't forget your end of the bargain, that girl. What about that last case? Ruth, we had a deal, right? So where is my emerald? Here you go. I found this. Why didn't you show me this before? This station square saved from a life-threatening missile attack. The city has awarded its main prize to the boy who saved Station Square. Miles Tails Brower was given the chaos as a testament of his heroic deed at a ceremony held at City Hall. <laughs> this makes things a whole lot easier. Hurry, go back to Earth and find them fast. I want the Chaos Emerald! Did you get that? Soon enough, Maria. This is Rouge reporting. Currently, I have not been able to confirm that Shadow is the ultimate life form or not. I will continue my research on Project Shadow and have a follow-up report very shortly. Just a reminder, don't forget about my jewel. Hey look, kart racing again, I only this time. 
chasing tails. So, this... If I remember, this one's actually a different track, too, so it's not as boring. But as a kid, that always bothered me. It's like, well, if we're chasing tails, shouldn't we be going basically the same level as we did before? But I guess not, since maybe we're on, like, a different on-ramp or a different highway or... I don't know. But... Among my many list of absolutely insane complaints comes... The fact that the uh, highway is floating in the middle of the air with no supports. Only a minor annoyance. Well, necessarily you have to be getting closer. Hey look! Wheels that aren't moving! I never actually noticed that part before. I thought they did move. Huh. I guess I goes to show you what video games were like back in Wait, are Rouge's tires not moving either? Holy crap, this is terrible. What, was the budget for moving tires not at, or not available? I don't understand. Keep your shirt on, fat lamb. Hey look, I wiped out. That was a first. Sonic's always been a fun game series, but... This is not what I think of when I think of Sonic. Uh, I'm just gonna level up or be honest about that. Kart racing is not at all something that I would... I mean, Sonic and Sega All-Stars racing aside, and I guess Sonic Drift wasn't a bad game either, but... I don't understand Sonic in a car. I don't understand cars in Sonic games to begin with. Most of the characters, most of the good characters anyway, and Shadow included, and Eggman is machines, can move in an excess of at least 300 miles an hour if Sonic can run at the speed of sound, and he's supposed to be the fastest thing by a decent margin. We'll say 400 miles an hour faster than everything else is alright. I don't think there's any vehicle short of a rocket car that can get that to that speed. In fact, justifiably, I think Rouge is the only character who needs a vehicle to accelerate at a high speed. But I don't know how fast she really moves. I know she flies. Tails' model looks unusually orange. Almost red. Like it's up a beta. All that crashing and I got a B rank? Holy crap. And we're going to finish up with Shadow's mission, Skyrail. Which is just Pumpkin Hill. Shadow, they're in that blue plane. Spotted at 11 o'clock. Copy that. I'm in pursuit. It's just Pumpkin Hill during the day with better music. Not that, like I said, Pumpkin Hill I enjoy, but I will always love rock music over Pumpkin Hill. Over rap, hip hop, whatever you want to call it. Unfortunately, like I said before, I'm not the best at rail or anything. So, bear with me if I lose miserably on this mission. Hey! That could have ended horribly. Hey, 
Hey look, it's a tank that you can't kill. I think those are only in... No! 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 Boy, I could have ended a lot worse. Like this is going to. Oh god, I actually landed that. I always die on that rail. I always die on that rail. I never get hit by that fire, but I always die on that rail. That's a new one. No. No. You might be able to kill those guys by somersaulting into them, but I'm not going to try it. No. Ooh, that could have ended a lot more, a lot worse than I expected it to. Holy crap, I cleared it in one go. That's what Here we, we call a shock. And with only four rings, I feel embarrassed. But that I will see so you hard. on the next episode. And no, it wasn't so hard. Doctor, they're heading directly toward us. What should we do? That was pretty rough. We did it! Let's go, Amy! Yeah! You little thieves! Did you really think we get out of here alive? Come and get some, Eggman! Just leave it to me! This time, I'm taking what you are, as well as the Chaos Emerald. I call on you to destroy these pests! Come on, my servant!